Hello, good morning. This is a video from my friends in the USA and Canada and other countries which speak English. Today, as a gift of Christmas, I'm gonna teach you how to insert or how to set up uh, an exercise for fourth axis here in Mastercam. It will look like this. Let me go through it slower. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Okay. How do we do that? I'm gonna start a new file. We already have a new file. Then you go to machine, you select meal default, and then you have to prepare your stock. You have to change it to cylindrical. In next, it's okay. You're gonna use a 300 by 300 stock. Mm, which is in diameter and length let's display it here in view we change to isometric ok wait 300 ok isometric fit and there here we got here we got our stock ok then we have to make the the wireframe we're gonna draw a a line let's fit it I'm gonna I'm not gonna use measures I'm just gonna show you how it's done so we have a line right so in this part of transform you're gonna use translate translate select the line you're gonna in the selection you're gonna copy the line and you have to uh, select the axis where you wanna move for example I'm gonna move 150 this and there you have your line okay in the Z axis okay then I'm gonna do the same but in the other way around Let's go to transform translate C minus 150 millimeters. There we go. It's missing one. Let's do let's do it by let's check if it's not double. Yeah, it was all. Okay, here we go again. Transform and late Translate Okay, now we have one line here, one line here, and then it, it the we need the y axis, the lines in the y axis. Translate. 
translate and selection y axis 150 and then again the line the center for the y axis Minus 150. Ah, damn it. There we go. Now we got our four lines which are going to be our chains here in Mastercam. We can erase the one in the center. It's useless. So, what's next then? You go to uh, two paths contour. You select the four lines. And then you can select your tool you can use a very big one so we can we can see what's happening here the cuts we activate and we place the the depth of each cut linking parameters everything in absolute okay you are gonna activate clearance everything in absolute for example in depth you're gonna place i don't know if you want minus 5 millimeters top of stock let's say 5 fifth plane 10 and retract to 15 and the clearance to 50 okay so the moment you do this mastercam starts doing this but this is not what we want where do we change in order to get a uh, four axis you go here to rotary axis control here in axis control you active a axis substitution and you substitute the y axis okay and rotary diameter you place the diameter of your stock so also it's very important to uh, when you got lead in and lead out, you have to deactivate them. Okay, so now we can see that it works. okay it's very important that to say that this is not easy to realize i had to read some books i had to do some tests but this is my gift for you or my friends in the usa or in canada or the people who is interested in to learning master cam i know that uh, this will help you a lot if if this helped you please give me a like share the video but uh, this is a gift for me to your people in this Christmas okay so have happy holidays Merry Christmas and see you there